Hey, what's up out there, YouTube? Double D here with Tournage Dubois. Welcome back. Today we are doing a piece of walnut. Uh, really excited about getting into this piece. It's got a little bit of a uh, extra limb over on this side that uh, we'll see what that looks like once we get into it. But I want to try some beading on the outside of this. So uh, my buddy Jim over at Garnered Wood loaned me a beading tool. So we're going to give that a try, see how that turns out on this piece. It's been drying for quite a while so uh, hopefully it won't see much movement or anything like that but we'll get to going on that. I did have a Indestructible Shoes reach out to me and I'll put a link to their Instagram down below about trying out a pair of their shoes. I'll put a picture of those shoes right up over here. Um, they have uh, different types of shoes. They have work boot style, tennis shoe style, etc. but they are all work related shoes. So they have steel toes, steel plates in the soles, things like that to keep them durable and keep, protect your feet during working times. I'm wearing them right now. I'm going to wear them during this video, give you my thoughts at the end of it as to what I think of them uh, in wearing them and giving them a try. So definitely check out their products down below. Take a look, see what you think, and uh, reach out to them and go from there because they do have some good deals on these shoes. So check them out. And without any further ado, let's get going.
Hey everybody, welcome back. Hope you enjoyed that project. So this was my second attempt to do any beading, the first one I've done on video. Um, so I have the finished walnut piece with the hole in it where the uh, branch split off but had rotted out, which I felt was a really cool thing to leave. I mean, let's be honest, it's not going to hold a lot of soup or cereal. We'll call it my popcorn bowl. Thought about filling it, decided I wanted to leave it natural. So we have our finished piece with, like I said, the beading on it that I had not done other than just one piece. Finished with the Mahoney's Walnut Oil. Uh, I'm really happy with this. I love the coloring of walnut. I love turning walnut overall anyway. Just a beautiful wood, cuts great, and I think smells amazing. I mentioned at the beginning of the video that I got the shoes from indestructible shoes. I am wearing them. Uh, I've been wearing them out here in the shop. This has been a couple of days with a couple of coats of that. So other project I've worked on, I've been wearing these shoes. They are really comfortable. Um, with my feet being the way they are, I'll probably replace the insoles at some point, but they are not as heavy as I thought they would be when I first opened them. I mean, they're heavy, but they don't feel that bad on the foot. They are protective. I've dropped a few things and they've the, the steel toe has helped. I've stepped on some things that I didn't have a problem with because of that steel plate that's in the bottom. So I recommend giving them a try. I give them a thumbs up for sure. Um, I'm really happy with them. I like how they look and uh, I like how they feel. So uh, I, you'll see them in future videos, I'm sure, but definitely check them out. Like I just put a link down below uh, to their information and their website. So check them out and see what you think. Hope you enjoyed that. If you did like it, give it the thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down. If this is your first time here, do consider subscribing. At any rate, we'll catch you next time.